Hey everybody, welcome to this video. I'm Inkslaura123 and this is going to be a come shopping with me video. Uh, so I hope you will enjoy the video. If you do, please click like and comment and please subscribe to my channel. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is just to nip into WH Smith because the post office is here and I've got a big bag of stuff that I've got to post. So I'm going to do that. Okay everybody, so I've posted all my packages and now I'm just going to do a little bit of shopping. I'm going to head into New Look, first of all, just see if there's anything about because I've still got some like birthday money, so I might find something, I might not, we don't know. Let's go inside. <laughs> I do like a bit of leopard print, red leopard print, look at that, that is quite cool actually. Okay, so all they've got is like size 8, size 6, um, yeah, no good, I am too chubby for those. Okay, so I've just tried the two tops on. I hope you can hear me by the way, because there's music playing. Um, yeah, so the sequin top is really nice. Like, it's really pretty. And it fits okay, but it's a bit short. I'd have preferred it a bit, um, a bit longer. And it's like 19.99, so I'm not really gonna wear it. And yes, yeah, so I'm not gonna get that. This one I really like, but it was just, it's a bit tight, a bit tight around the belly. I would have preferred it a bit looser, but I do really like the colouring. I've actually got a jumper like this that I got from Primark in a similar kind of colouring. So yeah, no good, no good today, no look. Next, I am gonna go to Peacock's, which is like a few shops along. Okay, looks like they've got a sale on in Peacock's. Okay, so I found this really cute umbrella with unicorns on. It's like pink and black. And I was like, ooh, I like that. But then I saw the price, £10. £10 for an umbrella. I just 
I can't do that, but it is really cute. And I like this one as well, with like the black and the gold stars. Okay, so I really like this skirt. It's like navy and pink. It's like a tartan kind of check style. It's really nice actually. So I'm gonna take this into the fitting room, see if it fits and see what it looks like. I really like these red and black boots, like they're so nice, but there is a problem. If I lift them upside down, I'll show you the problem. They're very like, there's no grip, they're very like shiny, so I always worry that I'll kind of slip over if I wear boots without like a grip, but they're really nice. I really like this bra as well, it's like a red and kind of black colouring, and it's reduced to four pounds, so I'm going to try this on. I absolutely love this, this is just so sexy, but it's like a six to eight, so there is no way that it's going to fit me, but it's so pretty, I just wanted to kind of show it in the video. the skirt fits but I don't like it and I think it looks a bit long as well okay so yeah I didn't like the skirt and I didn't like the bra I tried the bra on it was so tight I was like Ugh! couldn't breathe so yeah that was no good and um, so now I'm just gonna head to uh, next which is next door next door next anyway so yeah, I'm gonna go next and then as ever I have to go into Poundland my mum wants me to get her something and I was like, okay, if I have to go into Poundland. <laughs> Ooh, just thought I'd have a lay down while I'm shopping in this huge sofa. Ah! I like the um, pillows. It's quite a soft sofa, but it's really huge. There's another one over here. <laughs> I like this family. A group of people who live together and usually drive each other crazy, but share so much love for one another. Oh, it's true though. It's so fluffy. <laughs> Me and my friend here just hanging out. <laughs> anyway, um, so I bought myself a, a little perfume set. You get the perfume and you get a body butter as well. I really like NYX perfume, like they do some nice perfumes. Anyway, so now I'm heading into Poundland. Oh, Poundland. I love you, Poundland. <laughs> oh, I've got a big spot there. It's horrible. Anyway, so yes, I'm looking for my mum wants me to get these like dirty gnomes, like rude looking gnomes. So, oh, they might have some. She wants one for my boss. 
for Christmas. Oh no, they're not road. Oh no, it kind of is. It's got his bum hanging out. It's not the one she wanted, but it's quite funny. <laughs> <laughs> hold on there might be some more underneath hold on so um, I rung my mum up and I told her about the gnome she's like no I don't want that one because it was the one that I got the other day it had like a fig leaf on that's the one she wanted like covering up its bits anyway she didn't want that gnome moving on I found these fake nails how lovely are these I love the colour like that kind of turquoise and gold they're called majestic marble so they're for a pound I'm going to get them um, yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I thought I would get some DVDs because they're like a pound each. So I'm going to get Mean Girls that I've never seen. Can you believe that? I've never seen Mean Girls, but I know it's supposed to be really good and really funny. And also this one here, which is Confessions of a Shopaholic, which, as you know, I'm definitely a shopaholic. This is one of my favourite films of all time. It is so funny. Juice Bigelow, Mao Gigolo. It is just hilarious. I love it. Rob Schneider is just amazing. I'm going to get this as well before I go to sleep. This is based on a book. I've not read the book, but I know it's supposed to be like a really good thriller. So I'm going to get this. I used to absolutely love this film. It was so good. I saw it on Netflix recently. It's really good. I was thinking of getting this one. It's called The Unborn. Evil wants to be born now, but I don't know. It looks a bit too creepy. I don't know. Hey everybody, so I'm just walking home now. I can't wait to get home, I'm so hot. Like seriously, it's sweating. It's so hot. Um, but yeah, I had a nice little time shopping. I got some bits and pieces. I went in Poundland to get something for my mum, this uh, gnome that she wanted. Couldn't get it. Ended up spending 15 pound on myself, like random stuff that I didn't really need, but there we go. <laughs> I'll show you what I got when I get home, okay? But yeah, it's so hot, like I'm melting. I want to get home, freshen up. I want a nice cold drink. So yeah, see you in a bit. Hey everybody, so I'm at home now and I thought I'd do a quick little haul to show you what I got whilst I was out shopping. So first of all from Next, I got this little set here. It was £10 and you get a perfume. 100 ml perfume and also this body butter as well and it's called vacay vacay i love the uh pink flamingos and stuff on like the design of the packaging which is really cute and honestly this smells so nice i opened it up when i got in so nathan could have a smell and he was like oh i like it uh so it says smile pink pepper pear Heart, orange blossom, jasmine, soul, vanilla, coffee. But it's really nice. It's really got this really just, oh, really lovely smell. So um, they did have the perfume on its own for like £10. But for £10, you could also get this box set. And I thought, well, for the same amount of money, I get the body butter and the perfume. Anyway, so I've got that. Okay, from Poundland, I got these headphones. I'm going to do a separate video with these, uh, like a little kind of test and review kind of video because I've not really done anything like that before on the channel. I thought it would be quite cool. Uh, so these are from Sound Geek, and um, it says, Awesome! Now, I love the colour of these, like that chrome silver, and you've got the grey there. Um, they are over-ear headphones, which I like. They're more comfortable. It actually says for comfort and style. Um, so yeah, I'm going to try these and do a little review video and see what they're like. They were five pound from Poundland. Um, they might be okay. They might be rubbish. We'll find out. But they just look so cool. And I do need um, another pair of headphones for when I'm filming and stuff and editing. So yeah. Okay. So did I need any more soft toys? Probably not <laughs> but i saw these two little sausage dog toys and they're just so cute i love them so they were pound each from poundland and i love sausage dogs um i look at that little face Blah. so yeah i got these because they're just well they're, they're just too cute to have left in the shop <laughs> so i've got these fake nails uh, from poundland they are from the house of holland and uh, loving the colour and the design, they're called Majestic Marble. 
So they have like a marble effect and they like this turquoise and gold colour. Just so nice. Look at that. So, yep, got them. Okay, I got some Cadbury's Heroes. These are small little like miniature chocolates. You've got uh, chocolate eclairs, fudge, whisper, dairy milk, caramel, twirl, twisted uh, cream eggs. Now, these aren't for me. Unfortunately, I wish I could eat them, but I'm just so frightened of like my fillings falling out and hurting my teeth. So I don't eat any chocolate bars or anything. Uh, but I got these for Nathan just as a little, a little treat. So they were a pound, and he can just have a little, a little nibble on these. And yay, Poundland have started selling little squishies. So these are super squishy, and they're scented as well. Super scented, super squishy, super soft. So uh, this is like a little ice cream cone. Now, they're doing these sort of uh, little squishes in the works, but they're a lot more expensive than a pound. So I was like, oh, and uh, yeah, I'm quite interested to see if it does smell like ice cream. Should we open it up? Hold on. OK, so this is what it looks like. It's actually a little key ring as well, which is cute. Um, but unfortunately, it does not smell of ice cream. It has got a scent, but it's more like cleaning fluid than ice cream. <laughs> Oh, yeah, it smells like bleach, which isn't a good thing, but it does look really cute, and it is, it's very squishy, but yeah, it doesn't smell of ice cream. <laughs> okay, I also picked up some DVDs for a pound each, bargain. So this is um, actually based on the book by Sophie Kinsella, and it's called Confessions of a Shopaholic. So I've never seen this, and obviously I've heard about it, so it looked my kind of thing, bit of a girl film. So, yeah, and I'm a shopaholic as well. So, next up, I got Mean Girls, which I can't believe I've never seen. Like, seriously, it's a classic, but I, I know, like, roughly what it's about, but I've never seen it. It's got Lindsay Lohan in it. So, I got that, and I ended up getting the horror film that I wasn't sure about, but I did get it. The Unborn Evil Wants to Be Born Now. Um, oh, God, look at him in the mirror. <laughs> but yeah, so I I wasn't sure about this, but I thought, you know what, I'm going to get it because it's Halloween in a few months and I like getting some kind of spooky films ready for Halloween that me and Nathan can watch. It was a pound and it just looks creepy. And the other DVD I got is this one, which I'm most excited about, actually. This is Before I Go to Sleep, and it's got Colin Firth and it, Nicole Kidman. And this is actually based on a book that I've nearly bought the book before, but I didn't. So now I can just, like, watch the film instead. So it's a thriller. I love, like, psychological thrillers. And, um, yeah, I'm really, really excited to watch this. I think I'm going to try and watch this over the weekend because I really am excited to watch this. Also, I picked up two scratch cards that I'm not going to do. I was going to do in this video, but I'm not. I'm going to save them for my monthly uh, scratch card video that I do here on this channel. Uh, so look out for that very soon. So I've got this one here, Koala Cash. <laughs> Koala Cash. That's really cute. Uh, so, I mean, you're never going to get, like, amazing prizes on these, but sometimes you get, like, you know, free gifts in Poundland or you get a pound or... I don't know, whatever, we'll just do it. I just like doing scratch cards, basically. Uh, and this is called Seal Deal. <laughs> the se oh, no, sorry, Seal the Deal. Seal the Deal, I get it. So it uh, looks like someone's been at that one a little bit. Um, but, yeah, so I've got a couple of scratch cards. And when I got in, my T-shirt turned up that I ordered from eBay. I'll show you. So I've got this um, T-shirt made on eBay, like they print it up for you. So it's got the play button here, the YouTube play button on this side. And it's got my um, my username for YouTube and Instagram and Twitter and everything else. Uh, my, yeah, Minxlaw123. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I don't know. Like, I think it looks pretty cool. I think it's going to fit. But the thing I don't like about it is I wish this would have been a bit more centred. I wish my name would have been a bit more... Like, in the middle, like, if you see what I mean. Like, but, mm, I'm not sure. I mean, there is an actual uh, professional printers near me, so I'm thinking of, like, going in there. Because I, I had a lot of people asking me for, like, merchandise and stuff, and that'd be really cool. I did try this a while ago, and I bought some T-shirts, and I was, like, you know, doing it myself. But I'm just not creative enough and not very good at arts and crafts, and it just didn't go very well. So I think if I'm going to do something like this and that viewers can buy my merchandise and stuff, I want it to look professional and decent, you know, um, especially if people are paying for stuff. I don't want to send out things that look a bit rubbish. So um, I thought I'd try this from eBay to see what it's like. But, I mean, it looks pretty good quality, like the actual print and stuff. 
but it's just I just would have I don't know I would have preferred my name a bit more centered so I'm going to go into this other place that are local and see if they can like do sim something similar like this maybe the play button a little bit bigger or maybe the play button like in the middle and then my name like underneath or above it or something like that but this was just a kind of trial thing that I just thought I'd try from eBay but I'm still gonna wear it you know what I mean it's got my name of my channel on and the play button thing so I'll still wear this which is fine but um it's all kind of trial and error with the merchandise it's mad isn't it the thought of having merchandise because obviously I've got the two YouTube channels I've got this one um and I've got my ASMR channel as well so on that channel I've got like 44 yeah 44,000 subscribers on this one I'm nearly at 5,000 oh so close uh, which is very exciting I want a little party when I get to 5k um but yeah so people do actually want you know the the minxy merchandise so as i say we'll, we'll we'll still wear this one but i do want if i get them done properly i want it more kind of centered and stuff anyway thank you so much for watching this video and uh please you know click like comment subscribe and uh check out all my social media links are down below twitter instagram facebook goodreads minx law one two three asmr is my other youtube channel as well so check that out and I'll see you all very soon. Take care from me and all my goodies and the two sausage dogs. <laughs> and yeah, look out for a video with these because I'm going to be doing like a review, testing them and reviewing them. So I hope they work because they look so freaking cool. Anyway, I'm rambling. Thank you for watching. Bye, 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 bye. Bye. <laughs>